Hey guys, and it's another episode here of Willie B's Is the Earth Willie Round? No, I'm just kidding. That'd be a lame title for a series, wouldn't it? But look, how we know the Earth is actually round. I want to talk to you about this. I want to give a really quick thing. Let's look at the scientists who we point to when we're really saying the Earth is round and it's been proven. Right? So, the first to really notice this was Aristotle, okay? And then, but it wasn't until about the Roman Empire that it became a little more mainstream. But Aristotle was the first to really kind of put it out there. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. So, spherical Earth, yeah... Okay, that's a that's a theory, right? Okay. And I may be wrong on the on the Aristotle thing. On the Aristotle being really showing how we know it, but to me people talk about a couple different people and Aristotle is one of the biggest ones. So look, this is my problem with Aristotle. Aristotle really championed this idea of spontaneous generation. That's saying that animals can be created. Oh, look, there's just new species. Ah, there's some frogs. Look, they're just... Oh, see, look like maggots could arise from flesh. Yeah, you just put dead flesh there and the maggots just pop up. This is the type of theory of the guy that you're quoting when you said no, but the earth is round. I don't, this is absolutely wrong. There was never an edge, never stuff, I mean, I don't know about never, but that's not what I propose about flat earth. I mean, it's much more like the uh, paintings that they show, the old maps. I just I just don't think I just don't think the globe model really shows it and I don't think that uh, Aristotle is the best scientist to really hinge all your science on you can look at these other ones here just look at these superseded theories right these are theories that no longer anymore look even Louis Pasteur tried to, I mean, basically show that it did occur, did did occur. Um, that was just showing it was due his, due to his errors that filtered on stuff like that. Uh, transmutation, transmutation. I mean, you know, this is just. Look at these scientific theories. That we now say, okay, are not exactly correct or work differently like this. All of these scientific theories, right? Steady state theory. Hollow earth theory. This is superseded, so that means it's no longer like commonly held by the public. Expanding earth. Neptunism. Physiology. Phreniology. Do you want to hang your hat on science of old or see what the science of now tells us? I know my choices. You decide for yourself.